and you're not bad most TV entertainment without bad. tonight and guess what we are out to see the movie my village people i don't know what it is with your own village people but i know that village people cannot get me because i am covered by the blood of jesus <laughs> it's a fun night here in the city of lagos and you know of course we'll bring you all the fun glitz and glam right here on angela badmos tv and like i said this is the premiere of My Village People, a movie written by Bobby, and it's also the lead character in this comic thriller. Yes, they call it a comic thriller. That's a mixture of comedy and thriller. And it has Bobby, Rachel Oniga, Aka, Okem Awa, and a lot of other fantastic people on it. Tonight, we're about to find out what Bobby did to his village people and why they are after him. I know you want to know too, so if you want to, then you have to stay glued on this red carpet as we'll bring you the mystical black as well as the enchanted blue so it's gonna be double dose of greatness on this red carpet come with us my name is Elesha Moyosari Olua Ladies and gentlemen, let's listen to you. When I saw the cast of this movie, one name got me really excited, and it is Mama's name, Rachel Oniga. I was so happy, and I was looking forward to seeing you tonight, and you are looking so gorgeous. How are you, Ma? I'm good, and you? I'm very well, thank you. I love your enchanted blue. So we're supposed to be here looking either enchanted blue, uh, mystical black. I decided to go black and you're blue and I love it. <laughs> you, I know you must be very happy being on this project, but tell me, Ma, how do you feel? I feel so great. I feel happy. I feel elated. It's like I'm flying already. And we're all here to watch you on the big screens. Looking at what you cooked, do you think that we are going to be satisfied? I tell you, you're going to be extra, extra satisfied. And you're going to wish when you say when you see the end, it's like what's wrong with you people? How can you stop? I tell you. I can't wait. But Ma, have you ever had my village people experience? You have to now. I am <laughs> now. So how did you deal with it? And that is why it's a must watch, so that when you watch it, you know how to deal with them. We cannot wait, Mama. We cannot wait. Thank you so much. We are so looking forward to seeing you on the big screen tonight. Have fun, Ma. Padoski, they the grace. When they give you chance, so only you now we don't come. I greet you. You don't show lawyer worry any. They like everybody. You know, so I just combined so many personal experiences, the stories on the streets and try to make it into an artistic uh, picture. Are you anxious knowing that the work is finally here for people to see? Are you anxious in any way? 
I'm just eager for people to see it I, because I want them to have a good time. I want them to enjoy the process and I hope it helps to take filmmaking to the next level. Say that again. Right. Maybe you should see it first to decide if it's really horror comedy. For personally, I don't regard it as horror. It's spooky. It's more like scary movie. It's more laughs than there's there's no deep rooted story. Okay, for example, I can let this out. There's no blood. You're not gonna see blood in any scene. Who was your favorite person to work with on this movie? That's a question that'll put me in trouble. What was the biggest challenge working with this project? Because I have my own ideas. But Film One and Temple Motion Pictures, these are corporate bodies. They know the, the marketing angle, they know the business angle. They also know the business. They're always getting into arguments. But when I got to realize they, everything is for the greater good, they wanted a good picture, I had to bow down and let, let it take its course. And the result is there to show for it. If you don't watch this TV, I will freak it out, guys. All right. Wonderful people, my name is Eniola Badmos, and of course, I'm using this medium to remind you guys to please subscribe to Eniola Badmos TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news, you can get to what different entertainment updates, and of course, all the news going all around the world. Guys, do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content. Thank you so much, guys. And Hey, I love the vibes. How you doing? How are you? I know that you're very excited today because another of your banging works is the cinema June 11th. But may you express some by yourself. How you feel? See, I'm blessed to be here. You know, it passes excitement. You know, I'm blessed to be here. And you know, one of the interesting things I love about this movie is that you have transitioned from the zombie like the. You can't be pastor. How they take two out? I go do. I go do. Well, when I saw your character, I was like, ah ah, you been a pastor. Now you want cat village people. Well, shout out to the director, man. He's here. Now big old guy. He bent me. He bent me. I bent. <laughs> well, how did you cope on set shooting this? And were you able to catch the village people? Yes, now nah, because already I'm used to village people. So now we did here. Now now. I bought for now. <laughs> I beg. But you, so you yourself, you don't get village people experience. No, no. You get my, if your money finished, I would be it. No, village people. <laughs> but we know that you still have so many things in store for us. We are all excited. We should be expecting from you. More, more, great movies. Movie, so. Getting me, but I believe it's not. Yes, so let's do it. Yes, so so well. We look forward to it. We have fun tonight, and I cannot wait. That was too much. I work now. It's a joke. Thank you so much. How are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. Good to have you come out. How do you feel stepping out tonight? I mean, considering everything that's happening in Nigeria, we need this kind of distractions to actually take our minds off a whole lot of things. So yes, I'm actually pleased and happy. To be because you talked about Nigeria, let's start from there. How angry were you on Friday? Honestly, see, I think I've given up on this one, to be honest. As much as, I'm not giving up on I'm, I'm giving up on things as it is right now, so I'm honestly expecting whatever. So when I saw that, I honestly saw it coming. Because during the protest the last time, uh, we actually had scares of internet shutdown and all of that. And I think that is what to gradually going back to, considering the fact that it, they, they, they want to take away our social media. But then again, see, the spirit of Nigerians is resilient, and I'm sure that we're definitely going to come out of this, so yeah. I'm sorry I had to take you there, but I love the passion. Let's talk about the movie. Bovi and others brought us out tonight. And we are about to see our village people in action. <laughs> Let's talk about the movie. When you saw the trailer, what were you thinking? Honestly, I'm like, see, this is my dream, guys. We are killing the movie industry. Nollywood is definitely taking it one notch after another. And I think that's absolutely amazing. And I love the fact that we have started to write stories about our roots. Right? I mean, things that happen home. Because the truth is, no one can do it better than you. It's not the fact that we're positive to actually do this. It's absolutely amazing.
and I told you earlier on that I love it when people just come out to support their own and Basket Mart has definitely come out to support one of his own, Bobby. I was almost going to call it a comedy night, but it's all good, we understand <laughs> the tension going on here. How are you doing tonight? Very well, thank you. I'm doing and it's good to have you try out the mystical blue. I'm sure you put all of this together by yourself. Yeah, I, I am. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My guy went to the house because I was walking and I said, look for a blue jacket and a blue jeans. Take a picture, show me. Is that fine? Say fine, yeah, bring it. Yeah, let's move with that one. <laughs> no Don't worry. It definitely, he enter, he enter. I can guarantee you that one. So yes, tonight we're out to support Bobby and a number of other fantastic acts on this movie, My Village People. When you heard the title, how did you feel? Yeah, I felt it was, it was fresh, you know. Uh, it was fresh. I liked it. I liked the name because you know it comes. A lot of things comes to mind. You no, know, the movie. Or the, you know, the name of the movie. They count a lot. Yes. You know, this one. So. I know you're one of those persons who is big on talent, and I know that you must be very proud of Bobby right now. Looking at the works he has put into this one. Looking at the works Bobby has put into this one. What are you expecting tonight? Uh, Bobby is, uh, is like a perfectionist, so I know it's going to be a very good one. Uh, it's art. <laughs> okay. Have you ever had my village people experience? No. I mean, and nothing have happened. happened to you and you felt like, ah, my village people don't get me. No. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? 100%. Not even when your shoe caught for road. Nope. I've never used that word before. I swear to God and man, I swear to everyone. <laughs> I don't believe in all those things. All right, we're going to let you go right now, hoping that you have fun tonight. But again, I will see you in any movie soon. I'll do, I'm going to do Waka Pass in my own movie. Yeah, it's coming out in September, November. Yes, but I'm just playing like uh, just one or two scenes. I don't want to be inside. I want to be. I want to be behind the scene. Yeah. We're looking forward to it. Thank you so hey, much. Buru, buru. <laughs> and you're watching Eniola Badmos TV. Go watch on it. Keep watching. Ladies and gentlemen, guess who we have here? It is the Freaky. Freaky. Oh, yeah, Freaky. 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 <laughs> Mr. Macaroni is out here tonight. I told you it's almost feeling like a comedy show because you had to come out for Bobby, right? Yeah, of course, of course. That's uh, my yoga. Yeah, apart from being my yoga, I have a very good relationship with him. He's always very supportive. He's an amazing person. And I will do this over and over again. It feels like an emotional something right now. Let's talk about the fact that we've had so many transitions. I remember the last time I spoke to you, I talked about the fact that I cannot wait to see Anila. I know you are an Anila. So we see, we're seeing a lot of comedians do this thing. I mean, do movie big time. How does that make you feel? Well, I don't know how to... You see, today that people call me comedian, I thank God do because I didn't I didn't start my career off as a comedian. I'm a full-time actor. Um, it's just that I try to explore another avenue. Out of I don't I, I was tired. I was depressed. Now depression taught me to <laughs> so. But of course, that's that's um, part of what makes you an actor. Being able to play any role that is given to you. You know, so far you understand the role and you can interpret it um, to the best of your own understanding. So I'm, I'm very excited to be on Naila. It's a great project. It's an amazing one. I can't wait for everyone to see. And we are going to be here next to God willing. Yes, my God's good. Well, let's come back to Bobby's movie. Bobby wrote this movie and also played the lead role. What are you expecting? Anything Bobby. You are, I know people know already. Bobby is intelligent. Highly intelligent. He's on another level you know this is someone who is unpredictable you can't predict him from the days of extended family Bobby is is just is just different so my expectations are high and I know they will be met I can't wait for it also Mr. Macaroni you're amazing but before I let you go have you ever had a my village people moment so that moment where you say hey my village people don't come <laughs> uh, well I don't know. I, different times things they happen. Mommy, I know they relate to my village people, you understand? But of course there have, there have been different instances. For instance, 
you know, I went to four different universities. So yes, one issue. So from one university, hey, I say your village people. Another university, the fourth university, I don't write exam. I don't defend my project. We were simply awaiting convocation. I was expelled. So everyone, all my friends, the people were saying, I'm a village people to get, but boy. So you know, that's, that's pretty much. Oh wow, interesting. You heard it right here from Mr. Macaroni. But don't worry, never again will your village people get you. We are, by God's grace, we are doing well. Thank you so much. Have fun tonight. I still cover myself with the blood every day. Oh. See, together, let's cover ourselves with the blood exactly. of Jesus. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you so much for talking to us. We can't wait to see more of you. Can you tell us a bit of your works? Oh, yes, for sure. Please, as you're looking at this um, video right now, I just want to tell you that you are talking to the most trusted girl in Lagos. Oh, yeah, that's the name of my show. Watch it. It's on YouTube. It's a web series. It's free. So watch it. Go watch it. Yeah, Go watch it. Arc Flat. Watch out for Arc Flat. It's the first romantic comedy that I'm doing. So uh, it should be really good. It's been directed by Segi Lola, who's also on the men's club. She, pay, she plays Toya on the men's club. Uh, so there's the men's club as well. Inspector K. There's just so much, you know. Yo, follow me. The Nengers. Follow. Social media, yes. Follow me. Thank you so much for talking to you. Have fun tonight. so much. I will. You too. This is my guy. Lagos, so we told you tonight is going to be mystical and enchanting. And you can see the mystery all here. All of you. I mean, what's happening here? Mystery man, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Very well too. You want to tell me who is behind the mask? Your village person. <laughs> my village people have found me on this red carpet today. I'm Mystical man, before I let you go, come and share your village people experience with me. What's that thing that's happened to you? You're like, hey, my village people. Let me, let me tell you the truth. I'm the village person that is doing things to people. So all those things that they've been doing to your village people have been doing to you. Let me leave him before he does something to me too. Sir, you can go. <laughs> okay. I have one of my favorite out here, Auntie Martin de Lolo, one of Nigeria. Thank you. When they put Auntie, that means you are old. <laughs> no, it's not like that. It's not because of my love and respect for you. Thank How you, are you doing, ma? I'm doing very well. I'm doing yeah, The last time I saw you come out was at Omoghetto premiere. Oh, okay. Yeah. Now we are here again. Thanks to God that COVID is gradually going away. Yeah, we well, thank God. How do you feel coming out tonight? I'm very happy. It's always great for every woman to dress up and go out. And tonight we're here to see Bobby and some other amazing talent. When you got the invite for the movie, how did you feel? It, I know I knew it was producing, so I knew it was going to come anyway. So I felt really happy that it finally come together. And you have seen a lot of people do great things. Not even with God in recent time. You also do it so much, making us proud. Looking at the growth of Nollywood in recent time. Pushing Nollywood forward. Our relentless spirit. We never say die. We just keep pushing. And that's why you keep seeing things coming out. Nigerians, we're resilient, trust me. Right. I love that. But looking at this movie, My Village People, there's so many expectations, right? I know you have your own, but before asking what your expectations are, have you ever had the My Village People experience? Well, not really. If you well, it depends on what you wanna how your mind is placed. If you believe in that, you're gonna keep having experiences. Everybody has down times and times that, you know, they're going through stuff. So you can put it anywhere. So you can put it to rich people. True, so it is about like to mind. put it to my challenges. <laughs> and say that you're covered by the blood of Jesus, right? Exactly, exactly, I swim in it. We all do, thank you so much, Ma. We hope you have fun tonight. And I hope that Bobby delivers tonight also. I hope so. A feature film that just came out last week I, I, I'm not allowed to mention other channels, but it's online. Let's just say that. Look for Last Touch online. Yeah. We definitely catch up with them. Thank you so much. Let's
brings us way back or takes us way back to those times when we didn't have all the modernization and all the technology we had today. I mean, just take a look at this. This is what Bovis Village looks like. <laughs> it's been real right here tonight. We've had so much fun. And trust me when I say that, Bobby brought it 100% to this movie, and I can tell you for sure that this is one movie that you need to see. My village people was real rich, interested, and awesome all together. You want to know how Bobby dealt with his village people? Then you need to come out to see this movie on the 11th of June when it hits the cinema. I had fun, and I know you will too if you decide to come see it. I hope you enjoyed the glitz and glamour brought to you on this red carpet, because I loved it every bit of it guys we have to go now till next time when we come your way my name is Elisha Moyo Saralua and it's back to the village <laughs> wonderful people my name is Eniola Badmos and of course I'm using this medium to remind you guys to please subscribe to Eniola Badmos TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news you can get to what different entertainment updates and of course all the news going all around the world guys do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content thank you so much guys and Enola Padmos TV Entertainment without bad.